In this video, we'll write the net ionic equation for Na2CO3 plus FeNO3 3. So that's sodium carbonate plus iron 3 nitrate. Let's see, this one's a bit involved. There's kind of a lot of writing. First thing we need to do is balance the molecular equation. So I'll just write the coefficients here for the molecular equation. And you can watch my video on how to balance this if you're having problems. So this is balanced. Next, we write the state for each substance. So these two, they're going to be aqueous, dissolved in water so they can react. Nitrates, those are usually soluble. So we're going to put an aqueous two. That should be dissolved in water. For the iron three carbonate, they're very slightly soluble. So we'll write S after this. Essentially, this is a solid. So it's going to be insoluble in water. Next, we'll split all the soluble compounds into their ions. This is the complete ionic equation. So on the periodic table, sodium, that's in group one. It has a one plus charge. So put a plus up here. Carbonate, you'll have to look that up on a table of common polyatomic ions. It has a two minus ionic charge. Iron, we don't know just by looking at the iron, but the nitrate, nitrates have a minus charge, one minus charge. So we have three nitrates. The iron has to be three plus, balance that out. Product side, positive, negative, Carbonates, two minus. The carbonate is two minus. We have three of them. So to balance that out, we're going to have to have a three plus on each of these iron atoms so that we have a net charge of zero. We have the charges. Now we can split the soluble compounds apart. So we have Na plus, and we have two times the three. So we have six of these. I won't write aqueous after each one. We'll do that at the end. Carbonate, CO3, two minus. We have three of those. This three applies to everything. So three of those plus we have one iron times the two. So two of these iron three ions. And then for the nitrates, NO3 minus, we have three times the two. We have six of those. On the product side, we have one times six. So we have six Na plus ions, sodium ions, plus we have the nitrate times that. So six of the nitrate, NO3 minus ions. And then we have this iron three carbonate over here, but it's a solid. And we said we're only going to split the soluble compounds. So it's a solid, it's insoluble. So we just write it as it is. We don't split it up. Fe2CO3. Let's write an S just so we remember that. All right, once we've done this, now we can cross out the spectator ions. These are ions, they're on both sides of the equation. They really don't change. We start out with six sodium ions, we end up with six sodium ions. Let's just get rid of them. And then we have carbonates, no, no, here we go. Six nitrate ions, six nitrate ions. We can cross those out. And once we're done with that, now we can write the net ionic equation for Na2CO3 plus FeNO3-3, the sodium carbonate in iron three nitrate. And that might look like this. So this is the balanced net ionic equation for Na2CO3 plus FeNO3-3. And this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.